Okay, guys, look. This guy called to me and said, specific for this generator, the port side generator. He said, Mr. Lopez, in this generator, uh, the generator is two phases, and uh, one phase is 60 volts AC, and the other one 80 volts AC. And I said, that's not good. That's too much, that's too much. And he said, can I adjust in the spot voltage on the voltage regulator? And I said, no, why not? Above the because the difference between 120 and 60 is 50 percent, and the difference between 120 and 80 is 20, 30 percent. If the difference is small, for example, in both phases I have 105, 107. Probably you adjust a little here, and you adjust adjust those voltages because it's less than 10 percent, 5 percent. You remember that? Mm -hmm. But that difference, 40%, 60% of difference, is too much. But he said, no, Mr. Lopez, okay, okay, go ahead. And he increased, 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 and suddenly, and suddenly, explode. This one explode internally. And this one, look at the cable. Look at the cable of the faces. It's melted, completely melted. Okay. Never, never try to adjust the voltage if the difference is too much. This is for a small adjustment. You remember the second one is for a stabilization. What is the symptom? When you need, when, when, when uh, you can adjust this one, what is the symptom in the, in the, in the generator? Voltage. The voltage is fluctuating a little. When you put an analog, an analog multimeter in the output breaker, analog, you see the needle fluctuating. You can adjust with the second one, a stabilization. And the, the last one is gain. What is the symptom in the generator when the gain is not good? When you give load. When you apply heavy load, the generator takes too much time to recover the RPMs, no? Normally, when you uh, apply load, the generator goes down a little and recover immediately. But uh, when the generator goes down and recovers load, too much time, you need to adjust the gain. But those adjustments are for fine adjustment, especially the, the first one, voltage, no? The voltage, one phase is 40 volts and the other is 80 volts, that's too much. You need to check those, those, those phases in the back end with the megometer. Those phases in the back end with the megometer. All the back ends, they have a bore where the faces enter and the neutral enter. You remember, I explained in class. Those, all the generators, look, face, face, and face, face, neutral, and ground. You see? We can check those faces with the megometer and verify which one is good, which one is not good. Those are the faces, but the, the board is not here. And uh, what, what is this, guys? Run release, run stop. You remember? Stop. Run. Start, 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 stop, stop, run, run, and fuel, release. You remember that? Yep. Okay, and what is this? Look, what is this? 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 The voltage regulator. You have the voltage regulator, you have the relays, and uh, you have the faces here. But uh, unfortunately, I don't have uh, the, the board. Yes, my friends, you need the megometer all the time. For example, with the generator running, I connect my multimeter in the output of the breaker. Everybody follow me? And I see 105. And I start with the spot, with, with this spot voltage. A slow, a slow, a, a slow, a little, a little. Oh, 107, 109, 115, 121. Okay, I stop over there. I stop in 121 and I apply load, load on the breakers. Okay, more load, more load, and the voltage reduce a little, 120, and stay in 120. Okay, now it's good. Let me run the generator for 20 minutes with full load, and the voltage stay 120. Let me turn off all the breakers. The voltage stays 120. Let me start to apply load. This, 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 this. The voltage stay 120, and the frequency 60. That's good. Okay, this is ground. 
and this is one of the faces. Okay, and look, <coughs> this is zero and this is infinite. Where should be pointed the needle? Infinite. Go to zero. But, other one. Zero. Other one. The back end is completely out. The other one is exactly the same. I checked before. Good, guys? This is the only way to demonstrate to the customer is with this. No with blah, blah, blah. I need to replace the back end. Why? Let me show it to you. Because this, because... No, why? Why is zero and not infinite? Okay, this is the book. Check in the book. All right, and you can send to him the information.